Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve a network connection error message. Cannot enable shared access, error code 1061. The service cannot accept control messages at this time. So generally speaking, this may occur when there is an error or a mismatch between the request to control and the state of the service to be controlled. So there's a little bit of a discrepancy there. And in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve this without too much of a hassle. And we're going to go ahead and jump straight into it. So we're going to start off by opening up the search menu. Type in services. Best match or come back with services. Go ahead and open that up. Locate the credential manager. And double click on it. Set startup type to automatic. And if service status is stopped, select the start option. Note, if it was currently running, you want to stop it and then start it up again. So just do like a power cycle, basically, except you're only restarting the service. So go ahead and stop it and start it again. And honestly, it wouldn't hurt if you just did that anyway. So just go ahead and actually restart the service. And then once you're done with that, you're going to go ahead and close out of here. So apply it, okay? And now we're going to locate the application information service. And right up at the top, double click on that. Make sure startup type is automatic for that and that the service status is running. So set startup type to automatic and then I'm going to do apply and OK. And then once that is done, go ahead and close out of here and restart your device. And there you go. So hopefully your issue has been resolved. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.